Imagine if your favorite superhero traded in their spandex for a suit of armor that's not just shiny but scientifically mind-blowing. Enter the Scaly Foot Snail, Earth's own version of Iron Man, but smaller, slower and surprisingly, more metallic. This isn't your typical backyard snail, content with leafy greens. Oh no, this deep sea dweller sports a shell so advanced, it makes modern engineering look like child's play. Dubbed the Iron Snail for its unique metallic armor, it's the only creature known to integrate iron into its exoskeleton. But the real kicker? Its foot is adorned with scales infused with iron sulfide, earning it the name Scaly Foot. These aren't just any scales, they're like a knight's chainmail, providing unparalleled defense in the snail's harsh hydrothermal vent home. You might wonder, why does a snail need armor tougher than a knight's? The answer lies in the depths of the ocean, where life is more intense than any medieval battlefield. This snail doesn't sunbathe in your garden but basks in the warmth of hydrothermal vents at the bottom of the Indian Ocean. Imagine Earth as a tea kettle left on the stove, with hydrothermal vents acting as the whistle, letting off steam. These vents are where the Earth's crust has a bit of a leak, releasing superheated water loaded with minerals. Living here is like existing in a perpetual spa day if the spa were located inside a volcano. The pressure is like being squished by a pile of jumbo jets, the heat rivals your oven's self-clean cycle, and the water is a cocktail of chemicals most life forms would politely decline. Yet, our volcano snail thrives. Now, just when you thought Scaly Iron Snail was a cool enough nickname, let me introduce you to its alter ego, the Volcano Snail. Why such a fiery nickname, you ask? Picture this, the snail's home isn't just any old spot in the ocean, but right next to the underwater equivalent of Mount Doom. These hydrothermal vents, much like underwater volcanoes, spew forth superheated water and minerals, creating an environment that's both fascinatingly hostile and bizarrely cozy, if you're a snail with an iron suit, that is. So, the volcano snail isn't just surviving, it's thriving in what's basically a spa day at Mordor, decked out in its natural armor against a backdrop that could very well be a fantasy novel setting. This little guy's lifestyle choice really puts the extreme in extreme living conditions. Now, about that armor. The snail isn't dining on metal filings or sipping molten iron. Its shell gains its metallic sheen and toughness from the snail's home itself. The hydrothermal vents spew out minerals, including iron and sulfur, which combine to form iron sulfide, the same stuff that gives our snail its iron-clad reputation and scaly foot its unique defense mechanism. Think of it as the snail wearing a coat of chainmail at the microscopic level, crafted not in a forge, but in the natural crucible of its vent home. And, before you ask no, this magnificent mollusk poses no threat to us or any deep-sea denizens. Despite its formidable appearance, the scaly foot snail is a peaceful creature contributing to the ocean's ecosystem in its own unique way. It's a living moving testament to the resilience of life, showcasing nature's knack for finding ways to survive and thrive in the most inhospitable places. Discovered in 1999, a year when the world was obsessed with Y2K and The Matrix, this snail has captivated scientists and armor enthusiasts alike. Its discovery was not just a eureka moment but a wait what moment that has since inspired material scientists dreaming of new snail-inspired armors and coatings. And for those wondering how this eyeless explorer navigates the eternal night of the deep sea, it's all about the vibes. Without the luxury of sight, the scaly foot snail tunes into the chemical signatures and maybe even the magnetic whispers of the earth, finding its way and its dinner in the abyssal darkness. It's a reminder that in the vast, uncharted waters of life, sometimes you don't need to see where you're going, you just need to feel your way through. So there you have it, the scaly foot snail, a tiny creature with a big lesson on resilience, innovation, and the art of turning adversity into armor. In the depths of the ocean, it's not about the size of your shell, but the material it's made of, and sometimes the best defense is a good set of scales. As we marvel at the scaly foot snail's ironclad resilience, it leads us to ponder the myriad other mysteries lurking in the uncharted depths of our oceans. What other astonishing creatures await discovery, and how might their unique adaptations further challenge our understanding of life in extreme environments? Share your thoughts, questions or any fascinating marine mysteries you're curious about in the comments below. Let's dive into a discussion that explores the boundless wonders hidden beneath the waves. What do you think is the next big discovery waiting in the deep? And now you know stay curious.